Hey everybody, welcome to Hockey Skate Down. Before we get into the video, I just want to say thank you to all my subscribers. If you want to join our hockey team, it's free. Click subscribe, hit the notification bell to all. Thank you all so much, and let's get started. I want to do a video on the New Jersey Devils and talk about Alexander Holtz. Alexander Holtz was our 2020 first round pick, seventh overall, that a lot of Devils fans wanted to see drafted. He had potential, he had the makings to be a star scoring forward, and hasn't really lived up to it as of now. So this is a crucial, crucial offseason for Alexander Holtz to see what he can do to really try to take an NHL spot for this upcoming season. So I want to talk about Alexander Holtz in this video, so please stay with me throughout. So Alexander Holtz, he's 21 years old. He's uh, a left wing, right wing. He's a versatile winger for us. Six foot, 192 pounds. He's our 2020 first round pick, seventh overall. Uh, looking at his time, he's been splitting time between the NHL and the AHL. Uh, this past year for the, for the Devils, he's played in 19 games, three goals, one assist, four points. In 21-22, he played in nine games, zero goals, two assists, two points. So his NHL totals as of today, 28, goal, 28 games played, three goals, three assists, six points. In the AHL this past season, he played in 14 games, six goals, five assists, 11 points. And in 21-22 was his big year in the AHL. He played in 52 games. He had 26 goals, 25 assists for 51 points. So the scoring potential is there. But he's got to put uh, his all-around game uh, forward to really take an NHL roster spot. So, you know, with the potential, a couple of spots open for the Devils this uh, this season, especially with Tomas Tatar not being re-signed and, you know, him possibly being rumored to the Pittsburgh Penguins. I did a prior video. I'll link it at the end. You know, there's roster spots available. But he has to stand out amongst other uh, forwards really trying to make the, the team as well. You have Tom Fitzgerald really talking up Nolan Foote. In recent interviews, you have uh, Graham Clark, you have Tice Thompson. These players are going to really try to push for a position. And Alexander Holtz has to show that he can be ahead of those players and to earn a spot this uh, this uh, season. So in the in the exit interviews, they were very blunt with um, Alexander Holtz. They told him what they expected of him, and they told Alexander Holtz, this is a career-defining offseason. Um, they told him that this is a big offseason for you. You want to be on top of it. They know he's got the shot. They know he's got the makings to be a good player, but he has to work on a lot of other areas with and without the puck. You know, um, you know, Holtz has been working with, uh, he got help from a skating coach, Dawn Braid. Uh, Holtz's development and adjustment to the NHL pace has lagged. That's what Tom Fitzgerald really said about Holtz. Uh, Devils are still confident he can transform into a star scoring forward. So the potential is there for Holtz to really take a, a spot this year. And, you know, he's been uh, the Devils European coach, Essa Perrins, uh, has been checking in with Holtz and reports to Dan McKinnon how Holtz's training is going with the new trainer and conditioning coach. So, you know, they are monitoring to see how Alexander Holtz is doing, you know, with his uh, skating, with his playing, the way he's adjusting. And, uh, you know, he's been practicing with Jesper Bratt uh, overseas, and we've seen pictures of it going around and videos going around social media and you know, Jesper Bratt could be a role model for Alexander Holtz. You know, he's a late round, uh, six round pick that really turned his game around to develop into a star forward and, you know, got his big year this year. Where he got his big uh, payday and long term contract this year. So Jesper Bratt can teach Holtz how these smaller forwards can really make it in the NHL. You know, Holtz has really tried to monitor his game around his shot but there's other areas he has to improve upon he has to improve upon his passing the way he plays with and without the puck you know his gaps and you know he has to work on a lot of different things to really show that he could be a consistent nhl player so i'm hoping for big things from alexander holtz you know um i think he could be developed into a good nhl player he's just gotta play and that's the thing that a lot of devils fans were you know kind of upset about this past season where he wasn't playing in Utica for a long stretch of the to start the year. And then, you know, with the Devils playing so well, you know, even Tom Fitzgerald talked about it in his recent Spinning Chicklets podcast that Alexander Holtz was a victim of their success. And he took the blame for it. Like, he even said, I, I just didn't know what to do because the Devils were playing good. They were trying to get him into the lineup. But you don't want to throw off the chemistry when you're going on this huge winning streak and to throw Holtz in and really throw off the chemistry – of that. So with the Devils' success and the way they played this year, it was hard to insert Holtz into the lineup to really try and develop his game when all lines were flowing and going at that time. So 
With this, I really hope Alexander Holtz can put in a really good effort this offseason. We've seen the way he's been training with uh, Jesper Brad. He's been reporting to um, to uh, Essa Perns, and he's go going back to Dan McKinnon, telling him how he's been doing. So they're saying he's developing good. They're saying that he's really progressing. And, you know, let's hope for Alexander Holtz to really earn a spot this year. There is some spots available. So with other players pushing, hopefully Alexander Holtz can really stand out uh, during this upcoming training camp and preseason games to really earn a spot. I'm hoping for it. I want to see Alexander Holtz in the lineup. You know, I, I like when our youth is inserted into the lineup. It shows the Devils are drafting and developing well. And with a lot of other prospects, not only at defense, but at forward now, Holtz has to really buckle up and play good this upcoming training camp and uh, leading into the preseason game. So comment below. What do you think of, of Alexander Holtz's chances of making the NHL roster in this upcoming year? Do you think he does it? Or will the Devils go outside? Or will they just... Uh, bring up another player who's earned a spot as well. So comment below. What do you think about this? Thank you all for watching. I really appreciate your time. Smash that like button if you haven't done so. Subscribe to Hockey Skate Down. It's free. And join our hockey team. Thank you all so much. Have a great rest of the day. Great night. Take it easy. Stay safe.